NBC 15 News starts now. We're pretty excited. We have a really big announcement on the morning show. We have a new co-anchor joining us. And the great thing is she's not new to the Madison area. <laughs> That's In right. Fact, not even new to Wisconsin. Amy Fluxop, you're going to be joining us yeah. on the morning show this coming Monday and the 11 o'clock a.m. Yes. as well. Welcome. Thank you. I'm so excited, but can we fix the time that I have to get yeah, up? Yeah, welcome to this side of the clock. <laughs> yeah. It's been a while. Yeah. I did the morning show for a while when I was up in Wausau, so mm -hmm. I know what it's like to get up overnight. It's a little stressful at times, but the worst part, just getting out of bed, right? And then once you get going, yeah, the first it's, it's snap. First well. 10, 15 hours are the worst, and then after that, it gets much better. <laughs> I know. All right. I'm glad I didn't talk then to you, you get to before, lay down again. before I made this decision. <laughs> <laughs> I know. Well. Tell everybody where you're from, and you did okay. spend a huge part mm -hmm. of your life, and a lot of people here will appreciate this, on a farm. Yeah, yeah, I grew up in northern Indiana in, on a small grains and beef cattle farm, really big into 4-H and FFA, I actually have an ag degree from Purdue University, so I'm an ag girl through and through, so we're going to be talking a lot about cows, pigs, sheep, whatever, you know, <laughs> especially when bears come around, oh yeah. Who's our favorite Facebook page we visit? If you have not done this yet, you will get so sick of this. This is Christina and I's bonding moment. <laughs> yeah. Esther the Wonder Pig, you need to follow yeah. her on Facebook. Yeah. She is fantastic. Yeah, this is when we first began to bond up mm -hmm. in the newsroom. And yeah. I have sh shared some of her clips on the morning show with mm -hmm. mentioning Amy. <laughs> You know, so I'm so excited you're Thank you, and you're welcome. This. You know, yeah. yeah, I'm so glad I could introduce <laughs> right you to here. that one. So now you guys can compare farm stories because yeah. Charlie did some work on a farm. Yeah, I worked on a farm for years, actually, probably four or five years mm -hmm. while I was in high school. Mm -hmm. Actually, I started, I don't think I was even in high school when I started. Wow. But dairy, uh, right? Dairy, yeah. Dairy is a whole other lifestyle than beef. <laughs> scraped pens. Yep. Yeah, fed. The That's how you got thing, used to that yeah. early morning then, yeah. right? Yeah, I didn't get to drive any of the fun, you know, crops tractors because uh. that was a different part of the farm. It was yeah. a rather large operation that I worked on. But I milked many, many, many a cow. That's good. In my day. A lot of practice. Yes. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I worked at the Limited Express in California in high school. Excellent. Oh, we'll turn you into a farm girl yet. Don't worry. Oh, man. We'll get you some rubber boots and get you out dirty. Oh, boots? Don't get her any boots. Boots? Did we say boots? Rubber boots. Oh, uh, okay. But Not I have boots. cheetah rubber boots when I'm working out in the pins, so I am fashionable. This is, see, yeah. this is a nice cross. Did you? You know? I just went barefoot. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Hardcore. That's right. <laughs> I like the feel of it between my toes. Oh. So, um... What can Charlie get you on the first day? Because he, you know, he typically will mm -hmm. bring you, you know, coffee or tea in the morning. I love do you, that. Like, which yeah, do you that's what I'm known for. Coffee or tea. Oh, serving, I, serving you guys. I, I, I need coffee tonight. and a okay. big, I mean, a big thermos of coffee and black. So you like coffee? Yeah, nothing in it. Don't doctor it. Just straight <laughs> up. We could really strong. make the first day fun for this one. Well, I can I can give you some advice uh, on that. You you walk out that door, hang a right, and there's a machine just to your right. I'm just glad you know where it is, and I'll be uh, sitting right over there, uh -huh. and you know you can just bring it to me. Well, every morning. I won't be here Monday, so. Uh, that's right. He is uh, packing up and and moving into a new house. Mm -hmm. Don't worry, he's staying. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he's so, not leaving us. No. I found out that Christine knew where I lived, so I had oh, to find had to somewhere move. else quickly. <laughs> so can you see what you're joining Honey, in? Honey, we're moving. Christine knows where we live. <laughs> Thank you. And you know what? We already stocked his new house. My husband and I drove by last weekend to well, see Well, so it. we can yeah. do drive-bys later this week, right? Totally. All right. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. If you see a vehicle going very slow, it's Christine and I. I'll so, send Luke out to throw rocks. <laughs> what is... <laughs> yeah, ow, my ankle still hasn't recovered. Um, what is what is something that you're really looking forward to, honestly? Uh, not TV talk, but honestly being a part of the morning show. Oh, wow. Honestly, what I'm looking working forward to... Yes, he totally <laughs> took the words right out of my mouth there. Working with Charlie every yes. morning. Well, I figured that's probably what it was. <laughs> no, I still, I'm still excited to get the chance to do some storytelling and being, being out there in the community. I, I know a lot of times as an anchor, you kind of get chained to the studio, but for me, I still want to be out and about doing reporting, mm -hmm. telling the stories of the people out here because that's what I'm really passionate about. This is what I was doing this morning as they were like, can you come down to the studio quick to do this live cut-in? And I was like, uh, okay, yeah. give me five. <laughs> Absolutely. And you look great, so, you know. Okay, any concerns? I have a feeling I know what the one concern is besides working with Charlie. Working <laughs> besides with, working, working with Charlie? With Christine. Never. <laughs> 
we'll talk about that later. Not uh, now, at least. Okay. <laughs> no, I, it, it is just that hour. That, yeah. that initial getting out of bed. Anybody that's done a weird shift like this when you're getting up at 2.30 in the morning and you hear the alarm clock go off mm -hmm. or on these beautiful days that are coming and and you know you got to be in bed by like seven eight o'clock that's hard but hey, but the benny is that you're done by noon yeah and you have all day to have yeah, fun to soak up the sun mm -hmm. and see what's happening around town which is much better in the summer than the winter yes because there are times in the winter when you will leave on your break after the morning show and it will still be dark yeah yeah i know mm -hmm. not I know. for very long but it's easier to go to bed in the winter i, I know we talked about mm -hmm. that earlier mm -hmm. when we were chatting and i'm just yeah. like yeah, winter, it's easier to go to bed early because it's yuck out, the mm. sun's not out, you don't want to do anything but sleep anyway. Go into hibernation mode. That's right. <laughs> Save your sleeping for the winter. You don't sleep in the summer. <laughs> yeah, We're, we'll be really good at that. Yeah. So have, have people told you when you work the morning show, you're, you get used to it after a while, mm -hmm. getting up, they're lying. I know, yeah. I know. It, it only gets worse as you get older, too. Just <laughs> letting you know. <laughs> Again, glad I didn't talk to you before I made this decision. I know, I You've know. already signed, right? Well... Yeah, I did. Okay. Good. Okay. We're, we're, I'm locked. I'm locked in now. I'm here. No, it, you know, it is. It is a, you know, when we talked before, you know, the advantages of the shift uh, are the time, you know, the times that you're at work, but the disadvantages are the same thing. The, mm -hmm. the hours are the disadvantage as well as the advantage. Yeah. So you just have to uh, embrace it. Yeah. Enjoy it. We're going to have a lot of fun, so that's all that matters. So when we wake up, we'll get the fun, get the party started early, right? I think that's our new motto. Embrace the hurt. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I think that'll work. Anyway, Amy Flugsoff, beginning with us yeah. next Monday on The Morning Show. Amy, we could not be happier that you're going to be our teammate and friend. Yeah, I'm excited to join the team. I know it's a great one, so mm. let's keep the fun going. <laughs>